let's do this yeah I think I've played against them before, I must have. Alright, so we have an artifact for the welder. Can get. Yeah, this is not explosive, but it does at least have one piece of interaction. don't really want to draw mountains so I'm just gonna go mountain world uh, and then let's see what next turn holds but at least I can recruit for uh, an en engineer to get an ensnaring bridge perhaps Or get combo piece, something like that. Okay, work the over perhaps. Yep. Whew, and the clock is on. Okay. Okay. Do not want to have that get hit by wasteland. I think I'm just gonna play Crater Maker. I kinda want that one to survive, okay. First, I can go lightning bolt or something like that, but at least it cost him yet another card. There is okay. Mm -hmm. I expected. At least I can kill something. I'm definitely going to kill that. I have another stifle in hand. No, sorry, it is. So I am going to play out. I want to play out the painter. Do I want to attack first? Don't really see the merit in that. Sorry, I don't see it, the merit in, in playing out the painter first. So I'm going to play it now. Do not draw an do not want to draw an extra land, so I'm going to fetch with that before my next draw step. I have another days, that's good to know. They're not necessarily behind. Like I've got less cards. That's okay. Probably getting rid of the days. Yep. All right. Tell me, Gray. I 
Ooh, whoa, that's a lot of colors. Oh, they don't play red. Ay, caramba. They don't play red. Ooh, should they're a bit slower. That's good to know. Aye. So now, I do. Oh, that changes things. Two cards and lambs. I don't think I'm getting season pyromancer. So. <sighs> do it like that with the tomb. Then I can immediately also play other things out, but the artifact doesn't really matter much. I'm drawn to things. I I can still play it. Yeah, I can still play it. Do it like this. Can I play this season pyromancer out right now anyway? Huh. Blood Moon is going to be crazy here. Like, draw into Blood Moon, slam it. But I'm sure they, they're going to try to find a counter for the Pyromancer. This is just a bit too strong. Okay. All right. Ooh, that's also a really strong card. So, I'm gonna attack first. I mean, they will be able to attack with a flying at least. I uh, do need to play this one out first. They have DKs, but at least they're low on cards. And maybe they're saving up to counter this one. No, they're not. <laughs> wow, they play Stifle. Okay, they do play Stifle. Weird. I did not expect that. Alright, baby. Can't attack. Ooh, Stifle. On Season Pyroman, so that is pretty, pretty okay. I'm just going to play this one out. I'm not going to attack first. I think I'm just going to start grinding them out. No Dreadhood Arcanist to play Gurmark Angular, but hmm. yeah, I don't know. Let's see what's happening. There's a couple of cards I need to get rid of. Is that decay? Okay. Okay, right, now I'm letting them arrange the cards. Nah, it doesn't really matter. They're gonna draw one, the other two cards. Hmm. Unless they really want to avoid getting shuffle. So that's probably, okay, fatal push. Yeah, sure. And there's still nothing. Karn, like in that one. For LED, probably. 
kind of got a counter there. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's six mana. Hmm. I think I'm just gonna go for the next turn. Lattice. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, I am going to get the LED in case of days, spell pierce. That's kind of bullshit. I'm gonna play it out because they do have thought seizures and I'd rather have them spend um, a DK or something like that than thought seizures because I'm close to zero cards. I'm, I'm at zero cards in hand anyway. All right. Bloodmoon good. Bold. Meh. No. I don't really know lists like this. Um, I almost feel like my main deck is just pretty well positioned against this. Um, mm -mm -mm. Five last is amazing. It's just Crater Makes is great here. Plague Engine there is not that interesting. Trinity Spheres. Alright. Kind is good. They might bring in Surgicals. So they're not the thing is they're not as fast, right? They're not as fast as for Delver. They have this card, so I do need to keep card advantage things. Mm. Bridge is good. I kind of I almost just feel like keeping it like this. All my cards are good. They might get something to annoy the welders but I don't want to bank on that too much like they could get ley lines I don't think they play ley lines do they no but I think I think the main deck is just good yeah so keeping this all right I do like the blood moon here that's and I have the blast backup pyromancer and some yeah and, and, and some 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 uh, fast mana it's nice at least I hope to draw a soul land really it'll be amazing because then I can play blood moon with backup thought sees no thought sees so maybe spell pierce brainstorm fatal push Okay, that's nice. I'm just gonna play this out. It's nice to have a turn one play. Okay, mm, still would like to draw another land, maybe soul land. The blood moon is really key here. I mean, they can still decay in response if they have something. Is that the mana open? Soul land, come on. Come to daddy. No. <laughs> okay. I've got to play out of land. <laughs> Maybe. Just going to play it a bit slower, see what they do next turn. See what they reveal, and we could just get rid of the Delver. Oh, a DK. Okay. Hope they don't keep their mana open.
do keep the mana open. Yeah, so I'm not going to play into the DK right now. I don't, if I play Pyromancer, get rid of. No, I don't want to do it. I'm just going to play into the DK. The Blood Moon's going to be key here. This might seem weird, but I feel like all targets that I can counter, like Fatal Push, I could counter, but I just don't see how relevant that is. Sure. Knew that was going to come. He might have another one in hand, of course, but I kind of want him to tap for something. All right. I'm going to tap into counters, of course, or land. But I feel like this is where next turn um, I want to play Blood Moon. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to go for it. Sadly, they do have a fetch land now, but so be it. Four cards in hand. It's going to float mana for DK. No, okay. Um, two green. Interesting. Such an enchantment. Yep. Mm -hmm. So that could have happened anyway last turn as well, but. Yeah, I feel like I need to counter this now. Do I care about the food token is the question. Power blasted engineer. I don't care about the food token. Engineer for Grindstone. At least I have enough artifacts in the graveyard. The bridge is good. I'm starting to think of when I want to cast Pyromancer. Another Oko is a possibility always. Not a DK is <laughs> also a possibility. <laughs> oh well. So now if I draw land, I'm gonna play Karn. Recruiter. Mm. Do you still want to slow roll this? And the question, right? Karn gets countered. If Khan gets countered, is it bad? Like it's it's an empty board right now. So I feel like now is the moment to play Khan. Yeah. That's that's how it did have the days. Ouch. Now, at least whatever I play next, this, uh, okay, okay, okay. So like whatever I play is going to resolve, I hope. Tamagoyf, all right. Definitely going to cast 
Uh, am I going to cast a stone bridge? This is good. Let's see, a good recruiter for painter or something like that. Is that at least furthers my game plan? Bridge doesn't on its uh, in and of itself. So I would actually cast recruiter probably for actually do it for welder. I don't want to throw away my petal too easily. <sighs> Maybe I'm slow rolling it too much. Oof, ash, 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 ash. Okay, just give me a clear plan. Should have thought of Plague Engineer. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, that's good. I'm just gonna go for it. One card in hand. Could have stifled again, of course, but. Hmm, interesting. Why would you brainstorm now? No mana, no cards. Okay. So next turn I could, yeah, get Painter, play out Grindstone. They stay on top deck mode and they are Brainstorm locked. Which is not bad. Do you have a force of will? No. Then you probably would have counted that. Stifle. No stifle. Two cards. Play this one out. Doesn't do much for me now. No surprise element, at least. Hmm. This is the last card of the brainstorm, I guess. Make an attack. I think I'm just going to go for it in the upkeep. I mean, it's not going to get any better from my side. It's that fatal push. All right. Okay. 
tough. They're, they're pretty soft against us. Like if I had to rank the Delvers, then hardest would be blue red. Um, because they have wasteland, they don't care about blood moon, and they're fast with a lot of interaction. Then mm, rogue Delver, um, because they do care about blood moon, but they're still fast with a lot of interaction. And then um, Crixus Delver probably. I'd, they they have K commands and things like that, and still have interaction. It's still difficult, but it's a lot easier really because they even they're a bit slower and they care even more about wasteland and then and then you have um bug which is just very slow they fatal push but they don't play like five lightning bolts hey button <laughs> yeah i know well I'm, I'm also recording so i thought you know just in in, in case anyone ever watches this stuff. <laughs> yeah, and it actually helps a little bit of getting thoughts straight, talking things through. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's going to be weird playing magic uh, in paper again, because then you're not going to talk out loud, right? <laughs> um, I kind of like this hand. Yeah. Got access to the entire combo. You having a good weekend? Yeah, doing fine. I mean, I'm struggling a little bit with the heat and the humidity. But um, yeah, it could be worse. I have no clue what I'm playing against. What is this shit? <laughs> it's a merfolk, yeah. So they do play Force of Will, of course. And they might also play Days. I'm, I'm thinking it's... I don't know, this thing is just not good. It's a 1 mana 2-2. Two, two. One mana two two. I mean, yes, that's, that, that's what it's going to look like. Just, just they're going to beat me to pulp real fast. <laughs> All right. I'm not sure if Blood Moon does a thing now. I almost think I should just play Painter and next turn Karn, something like that, and I can counter something. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking just to, to, to see what they play and we could also always blast something or right exactly get into a bridge like now at least we could block and then see if they do some weird things we could counter or destroy something a lord of atlantis or what is it called lord of the trident <laughs> Okay. Okay, this is starting to get out of hand. I feel like I kind of need to blast one. Let's see, next turn. So th this is, yeah. So this is seven and then 14, more than 14 next turn. So I feel like I kind of need to. So I'm going to blast this, so first I'm going to attack, I'm going to blast this one and block that one. I'm not sure if that matters, but... It doesn't matter at all, but... 
No, I mean, the, the end situation is still the same of the amount of damage I'm getting. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna play Karn and get. Oh, gonna 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 play Karn. It's gonna hurt. And maybe I should have kept the red blast to make sure that this was gonna happen. Okay, now I could get LED. I could get. So the issue is these two lands. So they're gonna attack. Probably this is gonna be four four three t uh, three three. So it's gonna be seven. So I kind of need to block there, um, which is fine if I get a grindstone, put it into play, and I can weld, um, paint it back. So I think I'm just going to get a grindstone, play it, yeah. Or do I want a bit of protection from days? Um, so if I get an LED, play it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So maybe... No, I should... Yeah. They could attack and kill the Karn. I still feel like I need to play it out because... No, I'm going to need to... Yeah, I think... Uh, let's see. No, I don't need to play it out because I'm going to have to use the tomb anyway. So I'm I'm not going to play it out. Is that correct? Because next turn I play this out one and then one, two, three. Yeah, I think that's safer. Yeah the issue is now they could also draw a force of will, right? So um it's, 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 I don't know if it was correct not to play it out, but we'll see. True. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I, I, I should have played the grindstone. You're right. <laughs> yeah. Now it's just, do they have interaction or not? I, I kind of assume they do. They play Merfolk. Merfolk has a lot of interaction. So yeah, I should have played out, played out the Queenstone. But yeah, we'll see. <laughs> Thinking too much. You are just attacking with that one. If I don't block, I have four life. I tap one down. I could kill myself. I think I'm gonna block because then I still have welder at least. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a little bit scared. <laughs> yeah, but this is cool, like playing against a deck you don't know. <laughs> it makes things different for sure. Okay. They must have things to counter. Didn't even attack my Karn. All right, tap target creature. Opponent controls, lose all abilities until end of turn. Yep, that's a card. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, with Karn, I can get LED. So I think I'm just going to start playing out my cards, right? I can I can even play out the tomb. I could try to combo out this turn. So first, yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, but now I'm gonna do it. Let's see, am I gonna do it? No, I still don't really need to. I'm just gonna play the paint out. Like, or I could combo out, I could just combo. So I think I'm just gonna do, <laughs> do that. I mean, one card, what could go wrong? That's, that sometimes you just gotta go for it, I guess. Yep. Good. All right. No interaction. And they're like, where the fuck are my counters? Where are my counters? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I don't know what they play. I don't know all these merfolk, so at least they're all blue. Almost all. I don't think Blood Moon is that great. Plague Engineer might be okay against the tribal deck. Yeah, just choose merfolk, right? Maybe some more interaction. I mean, it's tribal, so Trinisphere could also be good. Like, right, that nah, is maybe true. A lot of Merfolk are about two or three mana anyway. It's rather about stopping the permission. True, they might have vial, but they're on the play, so hmm. Right, but that makes you right, that makes Trini Sphere worse, yeah. I think I think I kinda like this. Um the bolt seems a bit random, but it would be even more random if it was a surgical. I don't think surgical would be good here. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I kind of like this. Sure. So the last match that I played was against a uh, Bug Delver. And they are just slow. It was nice. Yeah, they were slow. <laughs> they were relying on decays and they they played a lot of a lot of decays and then Tarmogoyf and then I had bridge and then they can't do anything anymore. Kinda. Yeah, they got it got countered, but it's it's so good to draw out awkward plays. So it's nice. Um, as for this one land, I'm on the draw. I can draw an extra card. Oh, I hate one land hands. I think I'm gonna keep it though because it does have kind of the things that I want. I'm not sure. Difficult lands. Yeah, I think we can keep this. Yeah, I'm not sure if they play Wasteland. I mean, this 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 hand could be a trap, of course. <laughs> they don't. They're Merfolk deck. Sorry. Good point. Yeah, may maybe just a couple. And they could play crop rotation too, of course. Okay, like this is so typical. Already you're drawing two cards and none of them are lands. Yeah. Why are they not playing anything? They're a tribal deck. I don't even know what submerge is. Oh wow. God, that's that hurts. At least everything they play I can counter.
I mean, they're going to get ahead because I don't have any land. This is so typical. Why did I keep this? <laughs> uh, such a trap, such a trap. Oh my, what do they have? This is so odd. Eight, eight cards in hand. So I'm getting rid of Karn because I'm definitely not going to be able to cast that. Snack. Yeah. So on three, so now it is going to be two. So I got to respond to the next one. Yes. Oh, wait. So now it's on one level, right? And now it's on two levels. And now it's on three levels. So I'm going to bolt it. Yeah, it's 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 a good card. It's strange. It's such a strange deck they're playing. They play Hex Drinker. Whoa, whoa. Well, this is actually pretty smart of them because they're just gonna beat me to death with a six six, and I don't have anything. So I could draw a land and play Engineer. I, I just kind of need to find the um, bridge. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Oh, so punished so hard. Okay, what am I going to do with this? I think I'm just going to, the protection from everything is eight. And now it's three, four, five, six, seven. So I am going to cast the engineer. If they elk it, I will block. If I they don't elk it, then I will be able to I don't know, do something. <laughs> and they can draw a land, of course, and then go to eight anyway, uh, go to seven anyway, right? So it's three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, they go to eight anyway. But uh, then the question is, am I going to bin a grindstone or the bridge? If I bin the bridge, They don't really, because they can also elk the bridge afterwards, of course. Um. Okay, I think I'm actually gonna bin the grindstone because next turn I can... Mm, difficult. Yeah, I'm thinking of binning the grindstone because that leads me to a win. They will still have to elk it and I can block. If they don't elk it, the next turn I can play a painter and I can just sit on it. And if they elk something, I can swap and then the turn afterwards do something like combo out. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, what, what I mean is that, so if they don't find a land, then they have to elk the engineer or they slow themselves down. I mean, they can also just elk and pass, right? That is also true, yeah. Okay, they're doing this. They haven't played a land. Okay, this is not a merfolk. They're probably not gonna attack, which is nice. <sighs> yeah, 
here, this is weird. Uh, so I am thinking if I go recruiter. Now this he's just gonna give me an army of three threes. I could go painter and and ash. I almost think I go go painter and astrolabe to at least have the painter in play. I'm just not going to be able to get close to the grindstone. Yeah, I could go pyromancer and get rid of these two, so I still have a painter. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. Uh, bridge is difficult against Oko, so I think I'm actually going to win by getting playing multiple welders in a turn. And now I'm just going to go towards blockers. Thing is, they can keep pumping up. They have two mana open. Yeah, I think. Hmm? Yes, it's it's this is a difficult one. Um, let's see if I go recruiter welder. No, I'm gonna go pyromancer. Ditch these two. Just go wide a bit. Exactly, blast will be helpful. Okay, this is interesting. So, if I get playing paint to this turn, doesn't do anything for me, so I'm just going to pass this on then. It, it, it would go towards playing Grindstone and Painter out in the same turn, or playing Painter and then Grindstone and combo out in the next turn. Mm. So ideally I would get a Blast and a Goblin, something like that. Yeah, that's five, six, seven, still not enough, but what, what are the two mana for? What are the two mana for? Maybe the trickster, yeah. Mm, really? Huh. Uh, yeah. No worries. Attacking is not gonna do me any good right now. I might just get recruited for a welder. I don't know what else would make sense. Maybe recruiter for pyromancer, but I'm, I'm not going to go up in cards. So I think recruiter for welder just to force him to grow my army and not his own. Yeah. So this would be getting Welder. Do you want to play out Welder this turn? I don't think that makes any sense. It doesn't do anything really. So I'm, I'm just kind of growing my army. Once he starts attacking, that's going to hurt. So he's going to start attacking now, probably. And then maybe I could just kill his Oko when he does. Okay, it's, it's not making any... Mm. So he just wants to keep himself alive and meanwhile go to town with the Hex Drinker. All right. It's still 4-4, four, four, so he's still not attacking. Oh man, this is so weird. <laughs> Yeah. Right, maybe. I think I'm just gonna go Plague Engineer here on Merfolk. 
a painter. Painter and welder forces them to do this. Doesn't do anything else. And they're going to start going to for the beat down. Yeah, that's true. True, so I might just get paint. I mean, they, with Plague Engineer, they cannot name anything else, but they can grow they can grow their merfolk back because it's only one-sided, of course. Um, yeah. I mean, there's nothing I'm going to do either. Okay. I kind of just want to draw an engineer or a welder. Okay, sure. Still not big enough. Yeah, I'm gonna block that. Rather block all the damage I can now. Can't kill them. <laughs> um. Yeah, I'm gonna gonna play it out anyway. I think this is gonna call snake. Is that what he will be attacking with? I'm so tempted to play it. Yeah, I'm gonna play at the tomb. So next turn I can play at the city and, and have at least the opportunity for extra mana. And I should start picking up the pace a little bit. Mm -hmm. Dead in three turns. Two perhaps, but I have four perhaps. Hmm. Just not drawing what I want. Um, so now this kind of sucks. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to do that. Good point. Um, snake. Oh, they're getting kind of big now. <laughs> Bridge food, yeah, exactly. That 
that combination would be amazing. Still only attacking with that, oh man. Karn, I cannot play bridge anymore because of the uh, hex drinker, but I can at least play Karn. Sorry, I cannot play it any um, more with the bridge immediately because I got rid of the spirit guide. Um, but yeah, exactly. At the Oko. So what I would get. So ideally, I'm I'm just gonna get the bridge. Ideally, I will draw into uh, a blast. Uh, bridge. Yeah, ideally I would draw into a blast. I can get rid of the Oko. <laughs> Or maybe they just want to kill the car now. I don't know. And tap something. Sure. Sure. All right. I still have enough blockers. Does he have another one? I still have enough blockers. Do I? One, two, three, four. Yeah, I still have enough blockers. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Oh, he didn't use Oko. Then I definitely have enough blockers. And if you're only attacking with one, definitely have enough blockers. Oh, wait. Ah, right. Of course. Of course. Because the plague engineers are disabled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, good one. Good one. You know, the Plague Engineers actually think that Bolts would be better. And then maybe have it like this. Blood Moon is still not great. Oh, I feel so silly for keeping that hand. <laughs> Right. So I kind of like this because I at least have the slowdown and I have the welder. I think it's okay. Of course, blasts would also be beautiful, but can't have it all. This time they do have a turn one play. They have a turn one play. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna call blue, I don't see any reason to. I can get rid of pretty much everything they have anyway. Now they play the 2-2, uh, two, two. and I'm going to bolt that and block this. Gotta watch my time. Woo. That's fast. Okay. Nope, seems like a merfolk. Sure. OK. 
acá That's going to be snake No, I'm not going to attack no reason to. I might want to get rid of my <laughs> painter. Uh, okay, food token. No. Okay. I am going to attack now. the engineer shit and then he just has three threes that's that hurts right now I'd like to draw something important so I'm, I'm going to block with the painter now because I want to start using welder, I think. It's not attacking, okay. Okay, did we just win? We did not. I didn't need to tap it like that, but that's fine. At least we have redundancy. I'm going to get the grindstone. And next turn we can. Ooh, okay. Yeah, this is okay. If they do the welder, then in response we're going to swap because. Mm. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have played the land. Like they can do something that makes me. Sh miss uh or maybe the trickster uh, they, they, they could do they could trickster the uh, they, they could just kill the grindstone now but they could also trickster the grindstone in my upkeep they have some outs but I, I shouldn't have uh, played the land, there was no reason to, because now I've got three mana instead of the possibility of having four. That means I cannot use Engineer. So they probably still have the Trickster for my Grindstone in the upkeep. They don't. And I have two Painters in play. So, I think I'm just going to go to the upkeep. Grind them. I still have backup with the Simeon Spirit Guide. If they have two tricksters, of course, then uh, this is really silly. Oh man. Whew. Um loses all abilities. So actually it doesn't do anything. You're right. That's that's the same thing that Oko does. You're right to doubt it. <laughs> nice, true, true. Whew. All right. Um, <laughs> that, that, that was close. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. That wasn't bad. Okay. Yeah? No, what, what did you say? Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, it's usually going 4 1 or 3 2. Uh, yeah. In the beginning, when the deck wasn't really tuned yet, so there were, I had like two times at a 2 3. But otherwise, it's, it's going really well. And for uh, uh, Zarasias, it's also going pretty well. He, he actually has four 5 0s with the deck. So that's, that's really good. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm just. Yeah, it's so much fun, man. It's, it's really, really sweet. <laughs> I can't, it, it, and Zarasia is also saying, like, it's, it's one of the most fun he's had in a while with uh, playing Magic. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm just going to go to the bathroom. Yeah, do that. Yeah, enjoy. Yeah, thanks, man. Always a pleasure. <laughs> right.
right, let's see what we have in store for match number three. The combo. Okay. I guess I'll take that. Get countered. Try to find the land. I mean, this is one of those la hands where I'm kind of okay with keeping the uh, uh, the one land hand. Although often they're so completely garbage. Okay, do I want to play the petal? Nah. Cabal therapy, petal. So, let's see what they're playing first, but if I don't draw a land, I'm probably astrolabe to just try to see if I can find that land. And then play it, of course. Ideally a soul land. Just play out the painting immediately. Okay, else in fact. Mm. Maverick elves, I'm guessing elves. But if they do this they may have a turn to Green Sun Senate as well. So now play the painter. Still don't have enough mana. So I'm going to play the astrolabe. Nice. Okay, so now I am going to play the painter. Another green sun send it for the oof. That would kind of be the reason I do this to get to the oof faster. Hmm. I mean, it's not like they will have a turn two either way, but I'll you'll probably hang on to the green sun send it. Okay, maybe the uh, Titan thing, deck, whatever. Okay. Uh, the Knight. Let's kill an artifact. Hopefully they get the Grindstone then. Probably the sort of Painter though. I don't know, people are usually more attracted to killing creatures. Well, I can find that one with the recruiter. Okay, you're just dead. Play another land. No. Okay. That's all right. I don't want to show my uh, spirit guide. No. Okay, so Blood Moon is Blood Moon good? Blood Moon and the Dryad of the, what is it called? Dryad of the, Dryad of the ill, something, whatever, what is it? Ooh, Dryad of the Elysian Grove. Hey, hey. Uh, every basic land type in addition to the other types. So that is something of f uh, layers, I guess. So Blood Moon does not. I am playing against a deck 
deck with the, the Titan Dryad deck. I'm trying to figure out how to board against this. I think I want to put in Lightning Bolts for the oofs that they probably have. Um, otherwise, my deck is usually pretty good, pretty well positioned. Plague Engineers, turf, don't do much. I don't know the deck too well. I think Bloodman is okay. Because at least it stops Fala Cut. Cut. Fala. Cut. Cut. Fala. Thing. I'm probably going to try this. They're not too fast. They might play Force of Vigor. Not so sure. Alright, so turn one play. This bridge doesn't really do much. Um. So this is a one land hand that I would not be okay with because it doesn't really do much for me. This is better. Not a ton better, but a little bit better because I can at least kill something. If I'm gonna keep this. And, uh, I like the paint to redundancy. I'm gonna get rid of some fast mana. Of course, the Simeon Spirit Guide plus Fire Blast is always nice. That is such a good card. Like land grand plus plus. Kinda. Ooh, do I play the welder? No, the welder doesn't do much yet. I want to just make sure, I, I would rather draw another land. So I'm just gonna dig a little bit deeper. I'd rather play another land first than the city of traitors. Okay, that's good. So now I can go mountain, welder, and turn after painter. It's a bit slow, but it's yeah. I don't think that there's much that I can do that will make it a lot better or faster. It's funny when you no engineer well. This seems lackluster, but the difference between one mana cost and two is pretty big. Okay, and this is where you play oof. Mm hmm Oh, this is nice. I uh, should have maybe played the Astrolabe before. So maybe draw on a soul land. I don't. Ooh, Blood Moon is nice here. Hey, hey, grad student. <laughs> How are you doing? Yeah, yeah, doing good. Just playing, playing some games. I'm not into challenge. I'm just playing some league games. Um, you, you, you. I, I don't know if I've seen you around here a lot. You play. You actually play painter. Or just interested. Okay. Cool. Nice. Cool. Yeah, that's, that's that's fine. I mean, there's a lot of people lurking around in the end. <laughs> um, yeah, right? <laughs> that, that, that would be really great if you did because he's such a good player, but I can understand that if you play seven rounds in a row or uh, I don't know how many that it just gets kind of taxing um, all right this is this is not looking bad I think no I think it's yeah it's not it's not ideal but, uh, but it's kind of fine because I can okay I cannot play out the second moon but at least I can play painter have power blast up so I can block and things like that. I mean, at least I have a plan to get rid of the oof. <laughs> yeah. I'm 
not sure. Is he gonna attack? I, I think that right now I'm I'm just blocking him, uh, blocking them out. Um, cool. Grindstone time. I I would just really like to draw another land. That would be beautiful. And of course, I shouldn't forget that the pyroblast is for the oof if I want to do something. <laughs> yeah, so, so this is Imperial Painter with just a splash to black for the Plague Engineer on the sideboard. Oh, lovely. So I'm, I think I'm just going to play painter here because I, I can I need to play power blast anyway so I want to have some redundancy for the power blast oh the power blast costs two whoo the power blast costs two that's important uh whoo so maybe actually I don't want to do want a power blast end of turn this is tricky do I want a power blast end of turn do I want to swap? So I think I want to swap end of turn because they don't. Ha Force of Vigor doesn't do anything on their turn. They cannot cast anything right now. So I think I'm just going to swap. They're not going to play anything that I care about. Yeah, that checks out. I think that checks out. So now that is good. Uh, da -da 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 -da. So what I can do now is I could play this, blast at the end of their turn, then combo out in their upkeep. Something like that, because I don't want to have to deal with Force of Figure again in my turn. And they are just not drawing anything. Of course, I don't want them to draw basic forest, but that can always happen. Okay, they're just not drawing lands, that's also fine. So, power blast time. Then my turn. Bum, okay. <laughs> oh man, Blood Moon is so strong. I used to play Shortcake with one Blood Moon, but then it's like around this time of the year, last year, that I just switched to four Blood Moon because that is how you get Grixis Delver and Rug Delver. <laughs> right. Yeah, it get it gets way more toolboxy, right? Yeah. But but I kind of feel like by the time that it gets to that kind of refinement, it yeah, you really need to know your deck. It's a little bit like Strifo kind of really knows their deck and Jack really knows Shortcake and I feel like there's probably not that many people who are really good at playing Shortcake just because it's so uh, particular or specific um, and I definitely I'm I'm not anywhere near Jack's level with shortcake but this the this list is pretty cool um, yeah let me show it to you while, while we're waiting can, can you see this okay so uh, I could do this maybe oh shit the ma match has started sorry <laughs> whoa all right I don't think we'll be keeping this.
Okay, it's kind of mulligan this. Oh, there we go. Typical one land hand. I'm not keeping this. Besides Great Stone, nothing playable. Five, at least two lands. That would be better. Okay. So this is going to be a wild card that I'm going to probably try for. I don't know how helpful these are going to be. So I'm going to get rid of those. Um, because I don't know if I'm playing against blue. Thanks. <laughs> Down to five is always harsh. Oh, and of course they play blue. <laughs> Ooh, this Urza pal. Oh shit. Blood Moon is not good against them. Chalice on one. Most likely. Yeah, it looks like Urza Stompy. Yeah. Like when someone is taking this long and some tapping and untapping their stuff, I really feel like they are streaming. They they are talking with other people about. Okay, so what are we gonna do? Play Urza. Play Karn. Play Urza. Okay, play Karn. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Ooh, this is gonna be bad. I almost feel like just drawing a card, and then maybe just conceding. Yeah. The issue, yeah, the issue kind of is that then they probably know that I'm soft to Karn, but yeah, it's not like it's going to be. Look, I can actually kill Karn, but they can immediately kill, next turn they're going to kill one of my, no, they're, yeah, they're going to kill one of my lands. I'm not going to be able to play anything. I'm not going to be able to play anything. Um... I'm just going to concede here. Okay, Karn is good against them. Blood Moon, bad. Those gun coming out. Um, I'm actually going to see what I wrote down, what I want to do in this matchup, so I don't just constantly switch things around. So Trini Sphere is good against them. Definitely, if you have like turn one, turn two, that's fine. Also, with the uh, echo of eons, surgicals are fine against lead, for example. Blood Moon's bad. I was actually thinking of adding in the other grindstone too, because Karn is not to find the grindstone, Karn is to shut them down. Um, of course, the bolts could be interesting against their Karn. So if I had a bolt turn one, I could have just sniped the Karn and Karn is gone. Could bolt on assets too, that's actually pretty big. So then I'm actually thinking that the surgicals then aren't that amazing compared to, 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 to bolts, right? So I'd rather think something like this maybe. Maybe even just keep the re one recruiter in. S no surgicals at all. Like it's annoying when they start spinning their wheels. It might be good against Chalice, but there, there are other things that might be better against that. Of course, bolts and chalice are awkward, but that's the same with surgical, so... Yeah, I think I'm okay with this. That's awkward. Not gonna happen. I painted? No, it's nothing. Oh, jeez. Um... This is not going to cut it either. Okay, let's try this. Turn one grindstone and then just try to move ahead. 
Um, I think I want to keep my land, so that means I'll get rid of these two. Because I don't think they play... Maybe they play dismember, but I'd rather keep the lands. So it's going to be this. Ooh, this hurts. So I don't necessarily want to draw more lands, so I'm just going to go this way. Brrr. Turn three kill, we can do this. All right, lovely, thank you. Do they play counters? That's also gonna be an interesting one. Um, see, I'm just gonna jam it. Some of these decks play Force of Will. That's a super slow start for them. Unless they're gonna, yeah, vomit their hand now, play Karn now. Echo now, okay. Echo, play Narset, kill me completely dead. Mm. Yeah, ooh, this, this really hurts. And just get Lattice? Wow! <sighs> just get Lattice. All right. And just get Lattice. Yep. Well. Okay. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, no, I don't have any outs. Nope, don't have any outs. Yeah, no worries. See you around, ma'am. Thanks for joining. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, not five. No, this this last game was crazy. Uh, they had a, I, I had to mulligan to five. They had a turn one Karn. Then I had to mulligan to five, and they had a turn two Karn with lattice. That was uh, Urza Stumpy. Yeah, I, Urza Stumpy usually is a good matchup, but they can have really crazy starts. Yeah. Uh huh. Was it good? Oh wow. course right <laughs> yeah that's that does sound good yeah I'm not so sure either because then again the question is how quickly are you going to be able to put it down right so you, you always have a guy with uh, summoning sickness. Yeah. Yep. Or, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it, it fe feels a bit like a pipe dream. It's something that you could do in uh, Vintage with just Tinker. <laughs> They're like, oh, 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 Tinker Bola Citadel. Like, you just top deck a Tinker. They're like, okay, sure. I'll, I'll do that then. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, Mulliganing to five is so rough. 
And this, oh, this hand doesn't do anything. It's like expensive stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna play. Mm. Fine. I already, I already saved the furniture. Let's just do it. Yeah, I think there was one game where I pulled off winning with a one land hand, and the other ones are just mulligan because you get punished so bad. <laughs> yeah, started off really well, and then oh, mulligan to five, mulligan to five. <laughs> so let's see if you're joining for the Grixis control torturing fest. Goblins. I hope so, yeah. Come on, give me a land. Come on, guys. See? This is how it goes. This is how it goes. Ah! <laughs> no, come on. You, you need to have at least two lands in your hand. Four. Is that three? Yeah, three cards. Hey, Papa Smurf. <laughs> okay. So now I'm definitely going to play Painter. Yeah. A little bit the idea. Yeah, just draw a soul land next turn. Lucky. No. Oh, such a bluff, such a bluff. Like, I'm, I'm scared of Taskmaster, maybe Crater Maker, I don't know. Uh, true, you're right. Crater Maker does nothing. <laughs> you're right. But yeah, the yeah, other one costs four. Yeah, okay, so <sighs> the token. But why don't I just count? Oh, can't counter this. So I blast the token. Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. Now I just draw a soul land and win, right? Maybe I should have waited till they targeted, but yeah. There's not going to be another target. Yeah, that's okay. It's okay. Soul land, please. Thank you. No. Nope. So welder and and uh, oh no, just grindstone and keep the power blast open, I guess. Or I can weld a petal in. Mm, I kind of think I want to play the welder. Yeah, exactly. That's true. But then at least I will have the welder, right? Or one of the two at least. Munitions expert is good. Flash, yeah. That's flash. It's like it's a better gem palm incinerator. That's true, that's true. But hey, you get a goblin. Yep. 
that as well, yeah. Oh, it's so nice today. It has been raining off and on. So good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're not having a lot of rain. Oh, man. <laughs> Too far ahead. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I, Papa Smurf, I missed you. Jump on incinerate accounts, your opponent's goblins too. Yeah, yeah, it's uncountable. Yeah, but still, I've seen that people seem to be playing. Munitions expert over jump on incinerator. I guess really being able to target planeswalkers is huge. I suppose. I mean, I, I don't know. War chief. Right. Yeah, the trash master. Oh. Matron. Okay. Right, so they might still have a munitions expert. So I really just hope I'm going to find um, the lands, yeah. Or petal, also fine. Yeah, it's, it's just about the pyroblast, but, but I think I'm going to end of my turn uh, try it anyway. I mean, I don't know what Vile can bring in. Probably nothing. No, I should probably do it in the upkeep still. Yeah. Jump on incinerator. Oh, there we go. So what did they put on on top of the deck? They, they put gem palm incinerator on top of the deck, so now they have gem palm incinerator in their hand, yeah. I kind of like game one against goblins. We win. Alright. I suppose bolts are good. Blood Moons might be terrible. <laughs> so let's see what we're taking out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The Cyber could indeed be worse. Uh, I, I could even say, you know, it also, let's, let's do surgicals. It's maybe too much, yeah. What am I gonna surgical? Nothing. Yeah. You're right, you're right. I'm just being overly, you know. Power can use this. Yeah, I just hope to smack a Plague Engineer after they put down three goblins or something like that. Yeah. Right. 
Yeah, I, I agree, Papa. Um, the deck looks really well positioned against uh, goblins here. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's it's crazy how the bol the bolts would are genius because in matchups where Blood Moon is bad, Bolt is almost always not a dead card. It's a still good. Blood Moon has done work again, um, but L Blood Moon helped me get uh, Bug Delver. Helped me get the Titan. Uh, lands deck. Um, what was the other matchup? Merfolk. It didn't do anything against Merfolk, but there, then the uh, lightning bolts come in, and the plague engineer comes in. Yeah. Uh, what, what's her? Oh, it already came out. Yeah, yeah. So I think that's why the guy's playing, um, playing it in the first place. Yeah. You would kick his hand. Wow. <sighs> yeah, at least we're on the draw. They play Wasteland. Yeah, I'll, I'll, fine, I'll keep this. It's At least it's two lands, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. It also slows them down a tiny bit. I can't cast my second one anyway, but yeah. Yeah. Yep, as well. That's correct. Yep. Yeah, it's going to be very interesting meta. I think there were really strong creatures printed. Actually, from what I understood, the Snoop, the two mana, the two red uh, goblin, is not that strong. But it's rather the six mana legendary guy that's really strong. No worries. Uh, shit. I think I'm just going to attack. Okay. Fuck, you're right. You're right. I'm not paying attention. That's that's oh whoa 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 whoa. This is probably gonna cost me the game. <laughs> uh ow ow ow. You're completely right. Ooh, this is, I'm not paying attention. This was so silly. For one damage. This for for one damage. Oof. Fuck. And now he's gonna put put the trash mass uh, or the six mana guy in play. Ooh. Throwing it. Yeah, man, wild card. Kiki Joe, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh. 
Um, so next turn he could attack with two lackeys. I feel like I still need to play the Plague Engineer. Yeah. Oh man. I, I just noticed that too, man. I'm guessing getting kind of tired. Just draw a soul land and win, right? <sighs> oh boy. All right. Yeah, he ca I think he did need Kikijiki on top in the deck, yeah. And he needed to... Yeah, you need a Kikijiki on top. So the combo is Kikijiki on top, you make a copy of Snoop, 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 and so forth and so forth. And then in the end, you make a copy of the guy that changes the card that you put on the top of your library to uh, Mock Fanatic. At least that's one way to do it. Well, you guys nothing. That was completely unnecessary because this hand sucks. Yes. Beginning of the next end step, sure. He's gonna do it now. So confused. Trash master. I suppose he had it in there. Yep. So why doesn't Plague Engineer seem to work? Why does this say 2-2? Two, two? Why does this say 2-2? Two, two? Now it's just 3-3. Three, three. Ah, yeah, you're right. Oof, so confused. I'm happy that this is my last game. I am not taking this well. <laughs> and then he's just gonna kill my stuff and I'll be dead. That attack with the painter. <laughs> Ooh, yep, 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 yep. Now, the thing is if I draw, is that right? No, even if I draw a black source, then I'm not gonna wipe the board because this is 3-3, three, three, yeah. Wow, I'm showing you some terrible plays. <laughs> oh Jesus, yeah.
that you? <laughs> I mean, it would have gone down to two at the end of my turn. He makes a copy. Yeah. Okay. Guess I got to slow down a little bit. Oh, it, it didn't really matter because all their creatures would have stayed alive. I would have gone to two. I, I would have gone to two life because of the ancient tomb. Uh, no, I would have gone to one life because it was a fetch. And then they just attack. They, they, create, a, they create a token. Uh, not with the trash master in play. They're just one ones. Yeah. Yeah, it's like... It's a 3-3, three, three. yeah. It's, it's huge. Yeah. That thing is really good. I'll try not to punt. I'll try not to punt. I'll try not to punt. Um. Oh, Jesus. No, it's not that bad. It's also not good. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep this. <sighs> um, geez. Turn to plague and I can again, I can kill. The issue is they just, I mean, I, I have one combo piece. The issue is they search for a uh, trash master and I'm, I'm just completely gone. At least I can bolt, but it will be too late. I'm going to keep this and hope that, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm going to keep this and hope that the plague engineer is going to be good enough. And at least I've got one combo piece. Yeah, I do hope they don't waste. Thoughts is. Yeah. Goodbye, Plague Engineer, probably. And if they don't take the Plague Engineer, then... Take the Petal, nah. Right, exactly. Four painters, just find paint and win. Yeah, I do. And I think I'm going to cast a second grindstone off of the uh, furnace. Yeah. I also wasn't expecting thought seas, but at least their start is slow, but then again we're so dependent on what we draw. That's a nice one. So this gun this could be a next turn lattice. I think I'm just going to jam it. No, no painting on the sideboards. I'm I think line lines I like next next turn they can play a creature. I can bolt that. And then in my turn I play um lattice. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, 
what, what, what they could do, of course, is that end of my turn, and end of my turn, they play a munitions expert or something like that. But I have lightning bolt, so I think I'm just gonna plus on grindstone. <laughs> yeah, that's a that was a decent draw. Equip. Okay, that's that's a card. No, they're gonna call Karn. Yeah, let's get Painter. Why? I mean, I could, it's just... Yeah, I, I guess I could. Just, just, just to mess up what they could have. Sure, whatever. Wow. A wasteland and a vista. Yeah. Suppose so. Now, they can't use the vial. That's good. And they're lacking land. Yeah. So, yes, great idea to to mill them. That was so insightful because we just knew. <laughs> You. <laughs> yeah. True. I actually did that once against elves, where they had a, they had um, uh, had a stalemate. Yeah. Yeah. Four one. Oh man, I I'm I'm sorry for punting the second game. Oh, that was really bad. That was really bad. 